Hey everybody, I'm at Home Depot. I need to replace the strainer basket assembly in my kitchen sink. It started leaking and when I got under the sink and looked at it, it was rotted out. And uh, it's 18 years old, so I guess some, might pe some people might figure that's a good run, but anyways. So there's quite a few to choose from. And uh, of course the most expensive one here is uh, the Kohler. But you also got, you can go as cheap as the Glacier Bay Standard for 10 bucks. So the question is, which one do you want to spend the money on, right? Well, if you believe in just getting the best, you would think, okay, get the Kohler. But here's the interesting thing. This is the only magnet I could find in the tool section. It's a uh, pickup wheel for picking up screws and nails. Okay, but it's got a nice strong magnet on it. So, if I take this strong magnet and I take the cheapo $10 one, sticks to it no problem so no doubt about it there's no stainless at all in this thing which for 10 bucks I didn't expect there to be this one's a little bit interesting because uh, it actually says strainer SS which I would expect to mean stainless steel but guess what it sticks like a son of a gun I don't see any difference between this one for almost 14 bucks and this one for 10. That's for garbage disposal. All right, so we got one missing here, so I can't test that one. We got uh, this Glacier Bay, same as the cheap company one, but this one's 25 bucks. Well, this one, I can't seem to get it to stick barely at all. So there is... So I think what it is, is it's low-grade stainless steel. High-grade stainless steel will not stick to a magnet. Low-grade stainless steel, which is what they use to make a lot of appliances and stuff nowadays, will stick. So this is definitely sticking. Not as bad as the cheapo one. And then, you got the Kohler. Now, the Kohler is the most expensive by far at $42.77. And the Kohler st sticks plenty. It's actually sticking more than the Glacier Bay. But, at least the Kohler isn't claiming to be stainless. Basically just as polished chrome. There's nothing on here that says stainless and it just feels a lot heavier and thicker. I mean, quite a bit heavier than this one. So, 25 versus 42. Even though the back of the Kohler, the actual unit is marked China. Chinese, even though it's Chinese and it's not stainless, I'm gonna go the extra, what is that, 35? On an extra 17 bucks, I'm gonna get the cola.